How are you doing, you wonderful nerds? I promise I'm not turning into a YouTube drama channel, all right? I, I have a lot of stuff planned for Scoobtober this month, a couple more videos in the works for sure, but I wanted to give a take on something uh, that I'm a couple weeks late to, but what else is new? So I was watching uh, this video by D'Angelo Wallace, who, who's fantastic. I'm sure most of you know who D'Angelo Wallace is, makes great videos. And this is, like I said, I'm a couple weeks late. This is two weeks ago. And uh, I got lost in this comment. So if you don't know, this is about the Mr. Beast, Logan Paul, KSI uh, sort of joint venture called Lunchly, which is sort of a, it's meant to be a competitor to Lunchables. And it's just been very obnoxious. I've really ignored this. Uh, I mean, I've like followed it a little bit, but I've, it's not really in my wheelhouse to comment on it. But then I saw this comment here that said the less calories angle is so weird they're talking about that uh in terms of uh, lunchly i can play you a clip here this is a sort of a commercial for lunchly uh and i'll just play a little bit of it here for you also 30 less calories three less grams of fat and eight less grams of sugar turkey, turkey stack them 310 calories 230 calories 21 grams of sugar only seven grams of sugar so they focus on the calories a lot uh, about as this idea of oh it's fewer calories for kids uh so it's clearly healthier but as this comment goes on uh the less calories angle is so weird that's how you advertise to adults not children children don't need to worry about calories Calories. If anything, most of them uh, probably don't eat enough, either because of little child pickiness. Um, I was interested in this comment because it wasn't really an angle that I had thought about, but I did look it up. And according to the, uh, you know, National School Lunch Program meal pattern, this is on USDA.gov. Um, so these are the standards that uh, public schools have to follow, I believe, for how much, uh, how many calories and other nutritional info that kids need to eat uh, in a week or a day. And according to this, the minimum calorie count for children grades K through five, which let's be honest, that's who they're advertising to. The minimum is 550 calories. That's the minimum of what they need to be doing. So the fact that they're over here saying it's 230 calories, you can see Lunchables isn't even reaching that. And they're going even lower by saying, oh, it's 230 calories. This is extremely in a cynical way, I want to say evil. If I want to give them the benefit of the doubt, like this original comment was saying, this is how you advertise to adults, not children. I'm a person who has struggled with their weight for my entire life and, the, and their body image for, for my entire life, including literally right now. Uh, this comment is correct. I, I do believe this is for advertising to adults, but it's weird though, right? Because what adults are going to be watching this video that's just, it's edited specifically for children right look at this crunch bar feastables crunch yeah! bar. that this editing is for children right no adults are watching this and going okay maybe i'll get this for my kids it's specifically targeting children to be like oh i'm excited about this let me tell my parents about it and i doubt the parents or i doubt kids are even showing their parents this video either but the fact that they're spending so much time advertising the nutritional value or lack thereof in this case of calories it's so weird to me because children should not need to think about calories children should not need to think about how food is going to impact their overall weight or physical appearance that is how you raise children that have eating disorders and again as a person who has struggled with my body image my entire life including literally right now this is so disgusting to me. Children are growing, they need calories, they need food, right? They need energy. And especially because lunch typically is gonna be the place where they're getting the most calories. When I was growing up, I rarely ever had breakfast. Uh, I would, we would have you know family dinners a couple times a week, but not all the time. Sometimes it was just sort of like fend for yourself sort of a thing, because you know as a sort of person points out, um, you know family struggles and financial stuff. Uh, so the fact that lunch is typically where a kid would want or would get most of their caloric intake and they're advertising that it has fewer of these of calories that are important for children. 
It's so weird. Again, if I'm being charitable, this is for the parents to be like, oh, this is healthier for my kid, but it's not, obviously, as we discussed. This is advertising to children. It's getting children to think about calories. It's getting children to think about like their body weight, their body image, and things like that. I hate this, and it sucks. Um, and there's a lot of other reasons that this sucks, but I just wanted to get that off my chest. Um, more fun videos about Scooby-Doo and stuff coming up. Did I mention the plush? I have so many other videos. Hey, please support me on Patreon. That would actually mean a lot to me if you would do that. Um, links below. Anyway, bye.